Okay, here we are, October 23rd, and my mission today is to get this trailer over to Matt's farm so he can load up the two deer towers and to get these two 30 pound LP tanks filled and hopefully get them over to 211 and get them hooked up and hopefully I can get the furnace going over there. But I stopped in to fill up the truck and oh my gosh, man, this older gentleman came walking out of the bathroom and right away in the hallway I could tell it was going to be a bad experience. Man, I'm telling you, my eyes were watering in there. I mean, geez, I, I mean, I feel like he left part of his guts in there. Oh my goodness. Even just to do number one, man, I had to get out of there fast. My eyes were tearing up lungs were hurting <laughs> it was it was bad whoo so now I'm out in the fresh air headed to 211 try out these LP tanks um, and then tonight ham radio testing my second test we'll see how it goes so stay tuned all right some poor critter met its maker right here on one of these concrete blocks. I wonder if that's a dinosaur or something, you know? I'm gonna, if it's a rabbit, I'm gonna say a hawk or somebody brought it up there and used it as a dinner table. I, I can't see a squirrel being out here. There ain't no trees. There goes Brandon. Anybody recognize that? I'm sorry, Jordan. Anybody recognize that Intimidator? I'm out at 211, trying to get the furnace up and running. Um, long story, uh, the 12 volt system is down. I'm trying to figure out if the uh, trickle charger is shot or not. Alright, good news, I figured it out. The furnace now works, blows nice and warm air. I swapped the battery out and I'm gonna charge it and bring it back, but uh, we had accidentally turned off the converter switch and then the battery got just too dead. So we are golden, baby. Alright, I am with 
Tom W9RY in his ham radio shack and he's going to tell us a little bit about what we're going to see here and what's going on. Uh, today and tomorrow we're having a uh, simulated emergency test uh, whereby we do not have any internet, we do not have any cell phones, and we are operating under battery power and having to relay emergency messages across the entire state. So I am uh, currently relaying message from messages from Massac County's hospital up to uh, the uh, emergency operating center in Springfield, Illinois. So the plan is he's going to drive up them ramps as far as he needs to go to try and set that up on them two braces. Looking at tractors and we got these two birds that are just hanging around and yelping at us and we figured out why they like Branson's too look what we got in there look what we got in there oh she's right over my back right now 